Today in this 2018 Dodge Durango, we'll be having a look at and showing you how to install the DrawTight Class 3 trailer hitch receiver, part number 75713. Here's what our hitch looks like installed. This hitch features a nice angular design, which helps conceal it underneath our vehicle. And it's also tucked up nice and tight against our fascia. This hitch does have a unique feature that other hitches don't offer. And that's this attachment point right here off to the driver's side, which you can attach any of your wiring harnesses to, such as your seven-way round, your four-pole flat, or any other wiring harness that you may need. On the side of our receiver, you'll find our industry standard 5 8 of an inch diameter hitch pin hole to secure any of our hitch mounted accessories. You can pick up a pin and clip on our website as part number PC3. This hole here, closest to the rear, that's for a J-pin stabilization device. What that does is take away the annoying shape plane rattle of what is inserted in your receiver. Welded onto the bottom of our receiver and the frame of our hitch is our plate style safety chain loops. And these have a really large opening, so even if we're using a large safety chain hook like this one, we won't have a problem hooking onto it at all. This hitch features a 900 pound max tongue weight rating, which is the amount forcing down, and a 6,000 pound max gross trailer weight rating, which is the amount it can pull. It does support the use of weight distribution, and when you're using that on your trailer, your tongue weight rating stays the same, but your max trailer weight rating increases to 7,500 pounds. You will want to consult with the owner's manual of your Durango and not exceed what the vehicle is rated for. Now one thing many of our customers like about this hitch is that the receiver has plenty of clearance around it, making this a great hitch to use with their bike racks and their cargo carriers. Now for a few measurements to better assist you in choosing any hitch mounted accessory you may need, such as a ball mount, bike rack, or a cargo carrier, you're looking at about 14 and a half inches from the ground to the top of the two inch receiver opening, and about three inches from the center of the hitch pin hole to the rearmost part of the back bumper. Now that we've gone over some features, we'll show you how to get it installed. To begin our install, We'll open our rear hatch. Now we'll open our rear cargo cover here, fold it forward, remove this mat underneath, pull up on this cover here to gain access to our mechanism to lower the spare tire. You will need your spare tire tools in order to lower your spare tire, and they're located inside this compartment here. Lift up on the tire. In order to remove this white piece, you'll need to use a screwdriver to help pry it away from the spare tire hanger itself. Once you have it pried away, you can slide the hanger through the white piece, safely removing the white piece. You can slide this part through the center of the wheel and get our spare tire out. And now we find ourselves underneath the vehicle and we'll point out where our installation hardware is located. We have two 21 millimeter factory bolts. We'll remove these bolts. It's the same on both sides. We're looking at the driver's side right now. You may need to pull down your wiring harness a little bit so you have room for your socket to get on the bolt. Now with an extra set of hands, we'll raise our hitch in a position. And we'll secure it in place with the factory hardware that we removed. Now we'll tighten down our hardware. Now we'll torque all of our bolts to the mount specified in the instructions. And now we can reinstall our spare tire. And that completes our look at and installation of the Draw Tight Class 3 trailer hitch receiver, part number 75713, on this 2018 Dodge Durango. Thanks for watching. Click the link in our description below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com. And leave us a comment if you have any questions.